everyone. Good morning. The time is six o'clock right now. So these are the cards that I have right now. There's no, I don't have any, you know, a lot of special cards, but not bad. We'll see. We'll see how the game goes. So I've been wanting to go out for almost a week, and I'll just try to figure out how to step out once the drizzling stops. It's, it's still there's some slight drizzle, but I'll step out. and welcome back to my channel as you read in the title i'm going to be taking you along with me for the entire day the date is 8th november and the time is 6 o'clock in the morning and let me show you how it is outside i'm gonna go on a small drive like a ride i should say probably so it's been very long time since i woke up at this time So as I said, I'm going on a ride and uh, I don't know how far I'm going to go. I do have a place in mind, but I'm not sure if I can go that far, but um, wherever it is, and I just feel like taking myself out to get, to get some fresh air. So I will check in with you guys very soon. So I'm all set and ready to leave. I just want to show you the sun. So here I am, if you can see the Adiyogi statue, that's where I've come. I thought of coming a little bit closer but this is the closest I could get. Um, the actual uh, road to the statue opens at 9am and it's only 7.15 or something right now. But I, I thought I could just show you. I wanted to show you even closer but this is how much I could come. Ideally I should have come cycling but I, I don't have a cycle and I thought a good morning ride would be really good. So I just took my Vespa and came. My mother doesn't know that I've come this far. It's 20 kilometers from my house. And I had a plan yesterday to come here actually. But I didn't tell my mother where I'm gonna go. I just said I'll just go for a ride and come. So she's gonna watch when she's gonna watch this vlog and then I'm gonna get from her probably. So yeah, let's let's get back home. I think the time is 7.30ish, somewhere, somewhere around 7.30ish. Probably um, when I come to Adiyogi someday, I will vlog the trip and show you more closer. But this is how much we are getting today. And for the rest of the day, you'll again see me check in in between because I'm gonna go out and all those things. So I'll catch you soon, very soon. So the last time I did a day in my life vlog, it was, the weather was similar, it was gloomy, it was cloudy and everything and it's the same uh, weather condition even today. I don't know whether it's a coincidence or what but the weather just feels so amazing. There was heavy rain last night and I hope it doesn't rain when I go out today. I just had my breakfast, I had dosa for breakfast with a uh, green chutney, uh, coriander chutney. Um, I did not show that part because I thought I could do like what I eat in a day vlog separately. So yeah, I'm just gonna chill for a while and then uh, I have to pack because I'm traveling on the 11th of November to Trichy. So I have to get some packing work done and probably I will just show you glimpses of what I pack and everything when I pack. So we are gonna play Uno. Um, this is something that we do like you know, for half an hour, or say 40 minutes for one day. So I'm playing with my mother and my neighbor auntie. Both of them are not willing to show their face on camera. So you'll see my cards later. So this is game two, and I'm slightly happy with the way I, you know, with the cards that I have. So yeah, auntie, you know, this is Asha auntie. <laughs> <laughs> this is Asha Tishri won the first game 
and most of you have seen my mother in my previous vlog and on my Instagram stories. So let's start game number two. So the game is going on and we went for a second round and these people made me take like six plus two and I, and, and I took six cards and see how the cards have come. So Asha auntie, Asha auntie is power, like no really power. So I'll update you by the end of the game. I won. I finally won, and these two are still playing. So I won. I won after the second round. So this is what happens when I decide to step out of the game after a week. It's raining. It's blistering. There has been heavy showers and now it's drizzling and I seriously don't know how I'm gonna go out. I want to, I will. Once the drizzling stops, I just use the time to step out. But is this even fair? Like I've been planning to, you know, go out today for really like almost like a week. I would just quickly show you which perfume I used. So this is from the Body Shop. This is the British Rose uh, perfume. So uh, I use the Char Gel from Body Shop and currently I'm using British Rose fragrance. And some days I like to top it off with the body butter which is also British Rose. Since it's quite humid and cloudy outside today, I didn't feel like applying a body butter. So I just thought of topping the Char Gel with this perfume. So if you haven't uh, taken a sniff on the British Rose range, then you're missing out on a very beautiful fragrance. And uh, you can just sniff or you know see how the fragrance is in your hand cream because uh, the British Rose range has a very uniform fragrance all around their products. This is not an ad or anything like that. I absolutely love the Body Shop uh, as a brand, and also their products are so amazing. Uh, the strawberry fragrance from Body Shop is something that is raved about a lot, but I personally feel that the British Rose fragrance is something that is on the top list for me. So our first stop, I have come to the cafe today, which is in RSPM. And this table in which I'm sitting here is one of my favorite tables. This is where we sit when I come along with my friends. So I'm just going to make some content planning for YouTube and Instagram. And it's been such a long time since I took myself out on a date. So this is a coffee date with myself. So I've ordered my favorite vanilla latte which will come in a minute. And I'm just gonna sit and plan some content for my channel. So my vanilla latte is here and I've just started to plan the content for my Instagram. So once I finish filling up the next nine grids, I'll just move on to uh, YouTube content planning. So yeah, that's the plan as of now. So my next stop for today is for lunch. I'm meeting my best friend and I'm in the cafe called Infusions. If you are in Coimbatore and if you have not come to Infusions then you are missing out on the best hot chocolate in Coimbatore. I've tasted hot chocolate in a lot of cafes but it's the best here. You get that creamy authentic hot chocolate here and uh, from my uh, earlier destination from Cafe Coffee Day to this cafe it's just two kilometers straight road. So when I started from Cafe Coffee Day it was not raining it was barely drizzling 
it's like two kilometers and I, I just go when I came around one kilometer it just started pouring like you know it just started pouring out of nowhere and there was no spot for me to go and save you know safeguard myself from the rain I got completely drenched like I'm completely drenched and I then took another road where there are a lot of buildings and everything and I just took shelter under some uh, I think it was a tiny shop so I just took shelter there for um, I was standing there for 15-20 minutes and then I took my vehicle and came here and I'm super hungry my friend has had to come and I think I'll just start my lunch without him I don't know This was the hot chocolate that I was speaking about a few minutes back. The best hot chocolate in Coimbatore. If you are in Coimbatore then you should definitely come and check this out. Just look how creamy it is. I can't wait to dig in. So yeah. So this is the first part of the lunch. This is the fabulous four cheese pizza. Again a signature dish from this cafe. I had to take a video of it because otherwise you can't see how gooey and cheesy it looks because we will finish it off. I started around 4.30 uh, from Infusions to come home and I generally come in 20-25 minutes but uh, today it took me around 1 hour because um, that road which I usually come was jam packed with people and all shops were open and everything and I think it's Diwali purchase that's happening. So there were a lot of people on road, a lot of buses. I, I was rightly sandwiched between two buses. So I just had to, you know, walk along with my vehicle like this. Weather outside looks something like this. There's another shower that is expected. Wow, that was a lightning. I hope you saw that too. So on the whole, it was a very beautiful Sunday and so on the whole it was a very beautiful Sunday and it's been so long since I gave myself so much time. Yeah, that's thunder. <laughs> yeah, it's been a long time since I gave myself so much time and I've been so busy with my channel, my workshop and everything that I didn't go out to meet my friends. I didn't go out, uh, you know, for a coffee date with myself. I wasn't giving myself enough time and I am thankful to myself for giving this day for me and I just wanted to take you along and show you how I spend my day. Does it look like I just showed you the balcony a few minutes back and it's gonna rain, it's gonna pour, it's not gonna rain, it's gonna pour. I'm so thankful. the time is around 9 p.m. now and no Sunday is complete without a skincare regime so I'm gonna do some masking I've just scrubbed my face with my Innisfree pore scrub foam and I'm gonna be using the Himalaya Neem face pack first followed by the British Rose plumping face mask from the body shop it's been so long since I used this face mask so I'm gonna be doing this and I'll get back to you once I remove the face mask face mask is off and I'm good to go to sleep today it's been such a long day but quite an interesting one though and I'm very happy to have blocked it I'm very happy that you were able to follow me around for the entire day if you like this video then you will definitely enjoy my other two vlogs which I will leave the link in the description box below so don't forget to check it out I'll see you all super soon in another video take care bye bye